And welcome back to another episode of Barbershop Barber Talk, Talk Like This. this. I'm your host, Trader Barber. And this is your other host, Dice the Barber. R.I.P. Kobe. And today, in the building, we represent the motherfucking Super Bowl. We got my nigga Kenny representing them Kansas City Chiefs with up. me. Damn right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, we got my man. We got my man. We got my <laughs> man Derek White representing them motherfucking San Francisco uh 40 pooters. Forty nine pooters. That's what they are. Forty pooters and. Brian Lugo. Brian Lugo. He ain't representing Ow. nobody. He actually represented the Giants, but they ain't in the fight today. So nah, fuck it. Nah. We ain't talking about the Giants. <laughs> All right? But he's here to support his man, Derek. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to have a little fun. Like I said, today is Super Bowl Sunday. Y'all know I'm from KC, baby. I'm a Chiefs fan all day. I've been waiting for this fucking moment for 30 fucking years as a Chiefs fan, personally. And we about to win this moment. And one more, because they're going to lose tonight. Sorry, bro. <laughs> Can, 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 we, can we? All right. Can we get into that? But first of all, I mean, we we cannot. I mean, get past. Wait a minute. Mean. Let's first do our what's the name, and then all we're right. gonna get into that. Like right now, right. I want to come in on a happy note. Then we're gonna drop down in a quick second. You know what I'm saying? We all know what happened, dice. But right now, this is about the Super Bowl. I'm excited. You I'm excited? excited. Kenny's excited. Hell we yeah. understand the Bears ain't nowhere near the Super Bowl. So I understand this nigga years, don't want to talk about it. 50 years, yeah, man. Dig. We don't get you know what I'm excited. saying? But y'all know, two things we do to start our show off. First of all, we'd like to thank the Lord for waking us up this morning, allowing each excited. and every last one of us to be here. And today, dear Lord, let the Chiefs be the Super Bowl winners. Amen. Amen. Nope, amen. nope, nope. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I said amen real quick. <laughs> <laughs> nope, nope, nope. <laughs> You know they don't drink me. Cheers. Yeah. We Cheers. good. Cheers. 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 Salute. 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 Yes, sir. Now nah, you can say what you want to say. Damn good. Too late now. We already got the shot in. It's all good. It's all so good. anyway, um, second thing, uh, well shit, we already did this. We did the prayer and we did the shot. So, all right. So, um, sadly, sadly today, um, we want to talk about Kobe Bryant, the loss of Kobe Bryant and his. His daughter Gigi, uh, the others who were on the helicopter flight last Sunday uh, morning, you know, we lost them to this terrible, terrible incident. Right. Um, for me personally, man, the shit just still don't feel real. Nah. Yeah. It, it seemed like it seemed like a movie, bro. Like, I mean, j just just to to actually think about it, and it's like um, the only thing I could really think about, you know, I could think about the other families on there, and then like, I mean, obviously you think about Kobe and, right. his, and his daughter Gigi, right, and, and like. Me having a daughter, like, I'm thinking about, okay, like, you see your death coming to you. Right. And it's like, you know, like, as you're going down, you like, right. the only thing you can we do is, you know what I mean? Right. It, it's like, you from want to my protect your daughter. I, honestly, from my, un, from my yeah. understanding, it was, um, it was like, they, they didn't, didn't even know. It. I heard they, 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 they was it. going over the hill, and the shit just, like, clicked the hill, yeah. and it was boom, boom, boom. So it was like, they it was it, as much as we would like to have the movie storybook ending, Realistically, probably they probably that. were like number probably one. Number like one, that. if you traveling with your teammates, you probably ain't even sitting next to your parents. You know what I'm saying? You sitting closer to your teammates because y'all just the same age and we talking and having fun. Well, she you was next to Kobe. So I, I mean, regardless to however it went down, you know what I'm saying? I'm sure it was a panic. We, uh, a panic right. at first. I, I, yeah. Regardless, I don't even want to talk about that. You know what I'm saying? Because right. I don't even want to think about we whatever lost they a went legend, through. They, bro. Through you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's deeper than that. Like it hit. I mean, it hit. It hit real hard. You know what I'm saying? Like, it hit a lot of people real hard like, because you just can't believe it. And I mean, all the things that he done, you know, right. you know, the mama mentality, right. you know what I'm saying? And, you know, like him wanting to be like Jordan, him right. conquering this Jordan. This wasn't supposed to happen You know what I'm saying? And, and, and it's like, it's and everybody crazy. know, everybody know I hated him Kobe a lot. Yeah, you, you know did. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God, yeah, we I mean, had these arguments. Man, originally, him I started out as a Kobe forth. fan. You know what I'm saying? I hated him Kobe a lot. Woo. But when, when I got that information, like, that shit hit me heavy, like, you know what I'm saying? I had to really hold back more tears than I let out. You know what I'm saying? Right. Because e even though I, you know, I talk shit about him during yeah. the shit, like for every great, you have in order to be that, become that great, you gotta have that opposing opposition. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. That energy. You know right. what I'm saying? Not just me personally. Like it wasn't like, oh, I'm, I'm the only one against Kobe. Nah, there were other people like me. And so every time he would go out and he would prove us wrong. In those instances, and for me, silently speaking, though I never told none of y'all this, yep. right. I wanted to see him do it because if you want to be better than Jordan, if you want to be Yo. that great, right, prove me wrong, right. You know what I'm saying? So, Hello? I, I appreciate Cole. I appreciate Cole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We Hold up. 
I appreciate I, I appreciate everything that Kobe brought to the game. Um, no matter what, Kobe was he he was a symbol of excellence. He was a symbol of resilience. He was a symbol of greatness. You know what I'm saying? Just he was a symbol of, of, of being a, 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 a good father. Me, you know, I was a being. He man. was a symbol yeah. of being a good a father. A symbol of dedication, work right. ethic, everything, right. man. You know what I'm saying? He was he was an all around good dude. You know what I'm saying? So. A lot of people didn't know. A lot of people didn't know. You know what I mean about about Kobe? It's like, it's like okay. You know what I mean, when y'all see him on the court, everything is so serious right. and shit. You know what I mean? But outside of that, everybody yeah. said Kobe was a joke. Right. You know I mean, the Kobe thing. was That's funny. That's the thing yeah. that you I used to tell people smile. all the time. Everybody from when Kobe was a kid, because he had the balls at seventeen to say, "I'm gonna be better than everybody." Right. Right. right? Everybody always looked at his arrogance, like his that right. arrogance and that right there, because right. that's fairly that's a bold ass. Right. People took that. But the thing is, I mean, but I mean, but the thing is, that's how you mission. That's what Jason Jordan. That's how you supposed to be though. You know what I mean? Like, like you ain't supposed to take no fucking shorts. Like you supposed to go in and be like, "Nigga, I'm better than all y'all niggas." He even told Jordan. He said, "Nigga, right. you know what I mean?" He told. He, he said, "You lucky I ain't playing your era because I would have bust your ass." Right, you know what I'm saying, and Jordan would say they. Right. I mean, he told him that he, he they, they gave Jordan had a conversation. He's like, all right, so if you had a one on one against all the top, Jordan was like, I'll beat everybody except Kobe, except Kobe, because he stole my moves. Kobe stole all my moves. How I'm gonna beat somebody moves. who got that's all my he, moves? That's down. what he said. Right, and he's younger me, exactly. more hungry me. You right. know what I'm saying? Right. So yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I mean, like, like it, 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 it's crazy. So um. Right now, I got um, I got my pops on the phone. Yo, can you hear me? Yo, what's happening? What, what up, pops? pops? Yeah, turn up a little bit. Paul. Hey, what's happening, guys? What's happening? So, so my pops. You now, I mean, he told me a story. He, he he was like, let him tell the story. Oh, let, me, let me bring it in. <laughs> yeah, let him tell. The story. Nigga, let, let me bring the goddamn shit in. <laughs> you was about to start telling the fuck. No, no, <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> was, no, I'm not. <laughs> that nigga's about turning into Miss Jelly. Yeah, he told me a story. <laughs> no, no, Go but ahead, the, but the thing is, it started off like he he was like uh he was like yeah I got a story, but if I tell it, a lot of people might not believe me because everybody's gonna be like oh no I mean you got Kobe stories and this and that this and that. But he told me you know what I mean me knowing that he come from West Philly, right. and you know went to the school that Will Smith and everybody else went to and shit like that. So he told me a story. So pops, tell me tell him what you told me. Oh. Uh, all right, so. This was this was a little you know um, I don't know I was a little bit older but we had we had a in West Philly there's a uh, basketball court man I, I back basically that was like my home court uh, it's called Parkside on 52nd and Parkside and um, that was like the court it was like the equivalent of uh, Rutgers in New York you know what I mean everybody was there that's where all the lights were you know what I mean but. That was like my home court, and so you know you had to play. You had to be rough to play on the court there, because all the top names, you know, came near to run. And then uh, it wasn't, you know, a habit uh, letting young boys and stuff like that run with us. You know, what I mean, you had to be good. But this one particular night, man, this uh, young boy came up, and um, you know, they was talking. You know, oh, that's JoJo Bryant's son. That's JoJo Bryant's son. You know what I mean? And, you know, we all here. We, we, we didn't care. You know what I mean? And uh, he got on the court with us, man. And I'm going to tell you, I was not a Kobe fan. Dude did not pass the ball. Man, he took every shot, man. And we like, who the hell is this young boy on our damn court, man, taking all these shots? I mean, we was pissed. You know what I mean? He, he, he was making them, you know what I mean? But, you know, it was <laughs> You know what I mean? That's our damn court, man. You don't come up from right. our court. You know, because in reality, you know what I mean? If you from, you know, if you from the inner city of Philly, you know what I mean? We ain't never heard of no motherfucking Lord Mary. Right. You know what I'm saying? We never heard of that. You know what I'm saying? That, that wasn't part of the city as far as we were concerned. You know what I mean? We still would not know about, any of us would not know about Lord Marion. If if Kobe Kobe didn't go Kobe. I would. My mom graduated okay. from Lower Marion. <laughs> oh, that's what you know, my then grandmother you know that used to live in Ardmore. So then, so, so, so then you know that there's an Upper Marion. Yep, I do. You know what I'm saying? I'm that's from okay, North Side. That's what team you you know. But they don't talk about that. But yeah, that was my Kobe story because I don't think Kobe, I think he was like 15. Like they had just came back from overseas. They had just got here. Wow. And uh, I, I think his dad was trying to put him on the courts with the toughest players in the city. You know what I'm saying? And see, we didn't have gyms and shit. Nope. You know what I mean? Everything was outdoors back at home. We, you know what I mean? We couldn't find a gym to play in. 
You know what I mean? So everything was outdoors. So I think his dad, you know what I mean, to get him on that toughness when he was a young boy. I heard y'all say when he was 17, you know what I mean? That's, you know, that's when most people think that he got that, you know, arrogance. But nah, he had that arrogance, man. I'm telling you, the boy was arrogant. I ain't gonna lie to you. You know what I mean? He he did not pass the ball. <laughs> he did not. He just he just dribbled around everybody, man, and took it. I mean, he was you know he was good. But when, you, know, I mean, look, I mean, when you, know, you look back he, at it now, when you look back at it now, and like you yeah, said, we didn't know it was Kobe. When you look back <laughs> at it now, and you say like your boys was all telling you that's Joe 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 Bryant's son and whatnot. And now, in reflection, mm-hmm. as an older man, you see how he was mm-hmm. reacting around y'all because you say he was making them buckets. It wasn't out there like he was out there fucking up. He was out there actually. Nah, nah. He, like he was I ain't gonna stuff. ask. I'm not right. gonna. Ask. With all respect, dude, pops, was he doing y'all or was he doing y'all? Was he? Was he? Was, was nah, he was doing us, man. <laughs> uh, he was handling his own. <laughs> he was handling his own boy, young boy. He was handling his own. That's man. what I'm mean, saying. At that, at you can see. No, no, in all, in all reality, man, you know what I mean? There's a lot of talent, man, in the cities that nobody ever gets to see. Right. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So when you see a brother like that coming on the court, you know what I mean? You don't think, I mean, yeah, you, you know, you, you Jojo Bryant, son, we know Jojo Bryant. You know what I mean? I'm an old head. Jelly we know, Bean. We know, we know Joe Bryant. Yeah, we know him. You know what I mean? But we don't know you. Right. You know what I'm saying? And there's a lot of people that play ball. Right. You know what I mean? There's people, man, city. My man Daryl City likes Warwick and people like that that, that nobody ever heard of. You know what I mean? Oh, they, I'm, I'm, I'm talking Dean yeah. Bates age. No, I mean, yeah, I, I, you know I, th- I, mean? I think, no, I mean, about, I think no. at a, at, a, at a young age he already had that Mamba mentality. Because and, and, and yeah, and, that's and, my and, point. And, yeah. and, and the thing is, I think his dad knew he was like, all right, if you're gonna be if you're gonna be NBA ready, you if you're gonna go be good. Now, I mean, I'm gonna take you to go play against the roughest motherfuckers. In the city, exactly. you know what I'm saying, and, and, exactly. and, and he's always because because you got to think. Talent. Now I mean, Kobe been through. Now I mean, like the era with Jordan, and now I mean where where like touch fouls wasn't even being called. So Nigga, so in so downtown Philly, touch foul, fouls really ain't getting called. Exactly. Now I mean, so so like like, like yeah. He had, oh, you ain't getting your call. You're, you're not call. getting no call at 15, you nigga. Getting he's not getting no call. Yeah, that's what I'm he pro- which yeah, is probably now look, look. now look pops y'all probably the reason why when Matt Barnes threw the ball at his face he ain't flinched it's probably because ah. he was balling with them <laughs> legit he was probably a tough that dude because he, he didn't he didn't balled out with them because I'm sure well, y'all was trying to that. punk yeah. him yeah. when he was out there I yeah. know they was trying to punk him out there when when he's out there doing oh, yeah. grown ass men they like well, yo we about to put a well, grown well, man oh. on him right. They well, I'm going to be honest, right. man. I only got to see him that one time, you know what I mean? And, and you know, like I said, man, to me, you know, and, and most of the other guys, you know, we didn't know we didn't know him. So our thoughts was, you know, like I said, who is this young boy on our courts, you know, not passing the ball? Right. You know I mean, we could care less of making it and all that other stuff. It's like, nigga, you know, pass the fucking ball. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, it's like, hold on, you disrespecting us on our court, you know what I'm saying? Not only are you not passing it, you busting our ass. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you about to take us off the court. So that was like, and you from a place we ain't even heard of. <laughs> that's a great you know? story, though, because that, that, that's yeah. a testament to that yeah. dude's legend yeah. when he was a kid yeah. kid. Young boy, young boy. A kid yeah. kid. Before yeah. we any any of us knew about that arrogance, that's letting us know that when he was a little tiny yeah. kid, he was still about that. Yeah, he always had it. Yeah. 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 It's, yeah. it's crazy because, like, just like you said, like if I tell somebody that story, I'll be like, Yeah, my pops played against Kobe. Now I mean nigga motherfuckers looking like, nigga, your pops ain't exactly. play against no goddamn Kobe. So you know what I mean? So, so exactly. like, listen, like, listen, you ain't never story. met no Martin Luther the King, King, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I got a lot of story. I know a lot of people, man. I, I I know a lot of stories, man. So anytime y'all wanna call me, man, and hit me up on certain things, man, y'all hit me up. We gonna take you, you up on that. Bro. We gonna call up and we gonna call yeah. it Dice's yeah. True Dice's That nigga know song from Boys the Men. Like anybody I know songs from I'm boys from 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 song. Yeah, yeah. Like, I, mean, I grew up on the same block. Like Sean, Sean from Boys the Men grew up on the same block as I did. I went to high school with Carl Lewis. You know me, me, Will and Jeff. Man, we used to battle Will and Jeff. Man, back in the day. I want to know about the Hilltop his, Hustlers. I know Meek Mills. I know Meek Mills dad. You know I me. Mean? I know his uncles and all those people. Man, you know all that. We want to hear about the Hilltop Hustlers. We want to hear about them Hilltop Hustlers. I'm gonna have to interject here, y'all. Hey, we want to hear about them Hilltop Hustlers. Hey, Pop. 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 Hey, pop
I'ma have to interject. I'ma have I'ma have to interject. Though I am a though I am a product of Philadelphia. I already know about that. Yo, you already know. Listen, I'ma interject and say, though I am a product of Philadelphia. Today is about right, motherfucking right. Kansas City, y'all. Hey, hey, hold up. Hey, hold up. Hey, 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 real quick, though. Hold on. Real, real quick, though. I do want to say yeah, my yeah, deep, yeah. my yeah. I do want to say my deepest condolences to the uh, Brian family, Facts. along with the other family yeah, members who yeah, lost yeah, somebody, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Rest in peace, Cole, yeah, man. Yeah. We love you. We thank you for all the shit that you've done and yes, all sir. the things that you gave to us, yeah. man. Mamba yes, out. You rest in peace, Pop, bro. Uh, Mamba man. out, man. Yeah. Mamba out. This Pops, Pops, out. The Eagles, Pops, nigga. Pops, you an Eagles fan. That and was two I, I, years ago. I want to say y'all y'all shine that day. I want to get. I want to let Trey know. You know what I'm saying? That y'all could thank the Eagles for letting uh, uh, Andy Reid go out there. Whatever you say, man. Yeah. 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 Get thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Super Bowl. Bowl. We appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Andy Reid ain't got a good track record in the Super Bowl. Andy Reid got cheated. Andy Reid got cheated last time he was in the Super Bowl. You know Andy Stew. Let me say this, man. I ain't even gonna be a hypocrite. Yo, Andy Reid last year in Philly sucked. Sucked! I say what Third downs was horrible! Not this year. What he been doing in Kansas? We didn't know. Listen, hey. Let you know, nigga, we the number one third down team in the NFL, bro. So I don't know what he did with the Eagles. Listen, he, well, well, listen, he came he to Kansas, Kansas City and he took them eagle feathers and stuck them in the helmets of them Chiefs, nigga. Shit. <laughs> 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 we killed oh, Eagles oh, over oh, this motherfucker. Oh, 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 all right, man. That's right. All right, Pops. One. Love you too. Love you too, Pops. All right, man. Y'all be cool. Uh, okay. So, Derek, what, what you think? The, uh, what you calling the game, man? Here he go. I'm calling the game as a victory, brother. <laughs> Hands down. Yeah, right. No defense don't got nobody hey. to stop our running back. What Paul, about that offense, Paul, though? We need, we need we to open a, up. We got a 50-point lead on them. We, 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 we need to lead. open up a suicide helpline tonight. San- Cause these motherfuckers gonna need it. Sam okay. Fran better score it. fifty points. Paul, Paul they gonna, gonna need it. Paul gonna be here to take y'all questions bro. all night long. He gonna you walk you through it. That offense is strong, Look, brother. That you offense. Ain't, you ain't when you get close the to the edge, call Paul. Stop our running backs. Sam Fran. Yeah. They got a good defense, <laughs> but we got a better <laughs> offense. He said Sam Fran with an S. <laughs> you ain't stopping them boys. It's like a rainbow. Right. It's gonna be a good game. It's like a rainbow up there. It's like a, it it's gonna be it's definitely a rainbow, and I'm gonna be a part of it because we gonna be celebrating that six time championship to n- in a couple weeks. <laughs> <laughs> championships. <laughs> KC's taking it to them Frisco boys. Watch nah, them nigga, Frisco going, boys. That shit going back home to KC, dog. Lombardi Trophy tonight <laughs> is gonna rest at Arrowhead fucking stadium. I like, and we going back next year. What? I like, yeah, you can, yeah, you can go back next year, but you ain't winning tonight. <laughs> <laughs> we got this one. We got this one. You then ain't listen. winning tonight. I give you 15 fucking reasons why we winning tonight. God Woo. damn. I'ma I'm add, I'ma add two more five to that 15, and his name is D4 with two sacks tonight. Uh-oh. I'm calling oh, it right that's now. That's this I'm calling it. Hey, hey, listen. Let me ask. First of all, I got one thing to say. One, we not letting the we not letting y'all win simply because of D Ford cost us the Super Bowl trip last year. Secondly, yeah. um, Second. am I ask you, do you know what Patrick Mahomes' record is when he sacked three or more times in the game? Go be 0 and 1 tonight. 14 and 2, nigga. 14 and 2. We he take them sacks. Gonna be 0 and 1 tonight. I don't know what it was Reed, before Andy, tonight. Andy, he Andy take them sacks and stick them up your ass, ass nigga. <laughs> I that mean, so he about to be 0-2 probably. He say, take these sacks and stick them up your ass. Oh, y'all, look, we lost seven. Guess what? We about to get 27. Man, you know I mean, Trey's such a bitch. Like, like, <laughs> this, <laughs> really a bitch. <laughs> this whole ass nigga. This God. whole ass nigga. <laughs> Trey, Trey is such a bitch because, you know what I mean? Like, like, I, like, we all in the group text, so I send out a group text. I'm like, I'm like, yo, so we all going to Trey Crib to watch the Super Bowl? No. Trey was like, hey, this nigga cussed the whole box. Yeah, he, yeah. Trey, yeah, he Trey told was like, me Trey no. Was like, Trey was like, hell no. I'm watching that shit by my by goddamn self. <laughs> <side. laughs> you know, That's you what know, he told I me, said, solo dolo. Said, you don't I said, want to watch it with him. Nah, I, mean, I, said, I said, are you serious, bro? Like, man, I, I, I said, like, my whole plan, I thought I was. feelings about my team. I was like, I thought we was all coming 
to not mean to like watch no. the game with you. No, he's nigga, like, nigga, nigga, gonna be all y'all niggas is bad he luck. Need, he need to lose in peace. All y'all niggas is bad luck. About bad luck, nigga. But the thing is, now if they win, this ain't about you. I don't give a fuck about winning dice. They not winning. He's gonna win. By yourself. Damn right, motherfucker, because this is about me. This ain't about you. You don't give a fuck tonight, about the team. Don't Super Bowl about is about this community and, 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 nigga, and friends that. coming together to watch the ball yeah, for the fun of the team. Yeah, when your team's not yeah, in it, that's what it's about. where you watching it? I'm watching that my boy house in West Minnesota. When the Eagles win a couple years ago, I'll watch. Yeah, I might have to come over there. Guess what? Derek. Derek has seen. I thought his this nigga was gonna make. I thought this nigga was gonna make some some ribs. Nigga, fuck no, and, nigga. I mean, all types of shit. Yeah, yeah, we thought it was gonna be cakes no all in the house and shit. Fuck up my whole goddamn Super Bowl plan. Nigga, this nigga, this nigga I had to start searching me. around. Like, where the fuck am I watching this? This nigga, this nigga is gonna ask me. You what? What you cooking? Nigga, nothing. Nigga, I was there after the fucking game. I was there. I ain't thinking about no game. I ain't thinking about no game. I ain't about no people. No people around me. I don't want to hear nothing. Listen, listen, I want you here alone. I'm gonna let y'all know. I'm gonna let y'all know. I gotta do, I'm going to do it by my motherfucking <laughs> hey, self. I, listen, I told Kush yesterday. I said, this is what it is. I, I respect my friendships and my relationships. And for that matter, we should, I should just do this by myself. Because you come to my house, you say the wrong fucking shit, you will be put out in the middle of the fucking Super Bowl. <laughs> listen, and you're going to be listen, mad as a motherfucker. Listen, listen. Get your shit and get the fuck listen, out. Listen, listen. Get your drink, hey, you bro. Get I your fucking shoes you like and go. I, I wouldn't disrespect nigga, you like Nigga, you disrespect yes, me on the fucking text. Yeah. I had to block this nigga. Listen. Hey, yo. I had to block this nigga on the line. Listen. The nigga said, I'm watching this shit all the time. I said, well, fuck you then. You didn't hope the fucking Chiefs lose. I hope my own break his goddamn leg and crack. Block fuck off. So, so listen, before the game started out. last week or, or a couple weeks ago, he chimes in. I said, listen, man, if y'all want to talk, y'all go into a whole separate chat. Nigga, don't involve me. This nigga start talking. I said, Dice, I'm a block you got one more time and I'm going to block your ass. <laughs> that nigga said something else, block. Get the fuck out of here. I don't want to hear shit else you got to say. You know what I'm saying? So? And then, and then when the game was over, I unblocked. I said, "Your communication privileges have been restored." restored. <laughs> but the whole time, I was going for his fucking team. I don't give a fuck. He I don't want to hear that. The nigga this ain't even see. He's going for the same team. He's not coming to my house. Nobody no. is coming to my house, nigga. So no. it's not about you. That's a bitch move. No, it ain't. It is. Nigga, you celebrate your it's shit how you want to. It's, it's a preference. preference, nigga. It's my preference. Whatever, nigga. You call it, bitch, nigga, listen. I'm a bitch because I don't want to see listen, his listen. fucking face. This nigga <laughs> Trey. That this sound like the hoe. So nigga, ain't that what bitches do? Which I can't come watch the game with two of your boys. Nigga. This nigga Trey so Fucking hoe ass nigga. That nigga Take your fucking panties off, nigga. You rather watch the fucking Super Bowl by myself, nigga, with me and my team. Nigga, it's you gonna it's, watch it with your family and they don't No, care. nigga, they not even in this shit. Nigga, they got to get the fuck out too, nigga. That nigga when that I say solo dolo, nigga, nigga I mean solo he dolo. Been waiting 30 years. This nigga, nigga said the only 50. the only the no, only person, 30. nigga, the only person that is allowed. The only person that is allowed to walk into that no, room. That nigga 40, listen, that nigga 43. Listen, he been waiting 43. No, nigga, listen. Time out. Time out. The only person that is allowed to come into that room while I am watching the game Diego. is my son, Diego. Because Pop don't say shit. His only, I think he got one question. Are we winning? Yes, son, or no, son. Regardless, that nigga has a seat. Listen, this nigga, this nigga sits behind me on the bed. This nigga don't get involved. This nigga just watch me do know. what I do. Hey, you know that. what I'm saying? Hey. My daughter, my wife come in. They mumbling shit. They saying shit. Nigga, last time we was in the... In the uh, Pro, I let them come in, you know what I'm saying? And just like I thought, they start talking shit and saying shit. Fuck, I, I turn around, I said, you know what? I've been waiting for this for 30 years. Y'all fucking my moment up. Y'all got to go. Get out. I love you, but get out. I'll see you in about 20, 30 minutes. 30 right. minutes. I'll be out, nigga. Do you, do, so, hey, do so, you nigga, know, if, if my so family, if, nigga, if Trey, my this family. Nigga G offered to bring food. G said, no. I'll bring the food tomorrow. That nigga no. Trey said, no. That, that nigga G, G, G is, no distractions. I asked Ali. No. no. I mean, no I, said, I said, I said, why don't we do a Super Bowl party at, at the shop? Do yeah. yeah. it at the time, sorry, yo, nigga. Invite whoever the fuck you want to. Invite them to your fucking house. You know what I'm saying? How host your own goddamn Super Bowl party. Hey, my team, nigga. Hey, my team. Exactly. So I'm going to enjoy my team the way I I enjoy my team. Trey won't play this by nigga play. Trey, this nigga Trey, play. this nigga Trey, I said, damn, dog. The family can't be there. That nigga said, I respectfully asked Rosa to work that day. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, listen, last night I looked at her, I said, look, I look, said, that's some gay shit, work, right? dog. No, no, no. <laughs> that nigga listen, told listen, his wife to no, go to work. She said, she said, hey, she said, the job want me to work. She said, what are we doing for the Super Bowl? I said, 
I'm going to be in the room watching the game. You should probably go to work. <laughs> right, right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so last night I go home. We was talking. She said something. I said, ain't you got to work tomorrow? She's like, nah, I told him no. I was like, all right. Well, you know, room is <laughs> off limits, nigga. Don't bring y'all ass past the door. I will see y'all at halftime briefly, and I will see you after the game. Other than that, I don't Oh, I don't, oh, oh, my, my, my client Corday got a, um, he has a, a, a commercial right before the halftime show yeah. um, with uh, him and uh, Jonah Hill. Oh, yeah. Didn't I, I tell you? I don't. Didn't I tell you today is about the Chiefs? <laughs> fucking 49 ers Forty Niners. Forty Niners. Fuck about what you talking about? Hey, 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 that hey, shit hey, ain't hey. about the fucking Chiefs I or the Forty Niners, nigga. Cut, cut that shit out. I, cut, I, cut I just want to say one thing. I, I want to say one other for, thing. I cut his hair for the commercials. This for you. What's up? This for you. What's up? This for you. Trey's been a thirty-year Chiefs fan, but ask him what team he cheered for before the Chiefs. I don't know. I don't. That's what, it's on your hat. Oh, really? He's I was a Niner was, fan. I was he a, was a former Niner, Niner, Niner fan, fan nice. until we got Derek Thomas in 1989, or that's when they at least started to turn it around. Because Nick, my nigga said, listen, I said, I've been waiting 30 years. My homeboy at home said, Nick, you like 45. I said, nigga, nobody was a fan of the Chiefs in the 80s. Not one motherfucker. Christian I just, Okoye. Listen, honestly, listen, Christian Okoye didn't come until 89. Do you, it was at the, end, listen, at the end of the let 80s. Let me ask you a question. During the beginning of the... Let me ask you a question real quick. What? Do you know... The, the the Chiefs franchise, do you know what their names were before they were the Kansas Chiefs? Absolutely, yeah. the Dallas Texans. Texans. Okay, yeah, yeah. Nigga, I know my fucking, I know my team, nigga. Okay. In and out. Listen, I'm telling you, listen, yeah, okay. I, like, like I said, though, I was a diehard 49ers fan. I'm going to tell you, uh, like I said, Chiefs stepped it up in 89, which was unfortunately the same year Joe Montana got injured yep. by, the, by the New York Giants. Yep. I remember that shit. And right. I, didn't, I did not like the fucking 49ers. When they put uh, Steve Young in. So and what Steve was the first Young Super Bowl y'all great, won? Yeah. First Super Bowl we won? Yeah, Super 1970. Bowl. Super Bowl what? I think four. it was 69 or 70. Super Bowl 4, 1970. Well, Super Bowl 4. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> what other, that's, what that's, other the that's the only one they're going to have. That's the only one. What other <laughs> trivia questions you got? Right? <laughs> yeah, shoot them out. Nickel. Shoot them out. Nickel. 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 It's the motherfucking yeah, Chiefs. It's about about 49 about... 2020. Who's now, the all time leading receiver uh, 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 of, of all time? Where'd he play? Uh, he played for San Francisco. Okay. Who's the all time leading Talk scorer? About Rice. All time yeah, leading scorer. Y'all can have scorer. Rice. I love Rice. Uh, all time. Probably, let's see, I want to say Priest Holmes. No. What, for the Chiefs? Yeah, all all, he's the all time leading scorer. scorer. For the because, Chiefs. let's see, Patrick Mahomes, let's see, Pat had 50. Two touchdowns last year, or well, fifty-three, something like that. Um, Who would it be? So would he be the? He can't. He can't really be the. I mean, I don't know if he's I done enough be to be all time. That's yet. not your old wide receiver. Ooh, you ain't gonna get this. Huh? Tight end. That's not your old tight end. It ain't Tony Gonzalez. No, uh, no, no. It might be Tony Gonzalez. Tony Gonzalez. No, no. And you know what? You should think about it. Give me position. Give me a hint. Kicker. 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 Oh, Nick the kick. David, Nick Lowry. Nick Lowry. Yeah, there it is. There. Yeah. Okay, That's a lot of field goals. That That's too many. Days. Field goals ain't gonna win. Listen, the most, the Nick most career. The yeah. But think yeah. about this: the most the career, the most point oh, after the most career, touchdown. the most career rushing yards. Okoye. No, no. that's gonna oh, be uh, Jamal Charles. Bong bong. Okay. That nigga knows. He knows his Chiefs. That nigga knows. He's all about his Chiefs. Yeah, pull yeah. out the, the, the Frisco trivia. How pull many, out some Frisco <laughs> questions. How many yeah. championships have y'all won? Why oh, do we y'all won, talk with this? We won five. <laughs> Our mm-hmm. record is five and one. Why do they talk with us? Five and two. Right. right. Five and two. Uh, six and one, to be correct, sir. <laughs> five and Will two. Will they be spraying rainbow glitter at the parade if you win? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, niggas say yes. Hey, listen. How y'all, many, listen. <laughs> y'all might as well put yes. the rainbow glitter away because you're only going to need three colors. <laughs> how many? Red, how many, yellow, and, and the silver. Blow. He ain't ready yet. How he many How many this NFC West championships have y'all won? NFC championships, we won. NFC West. NFC West, I know. We, I think it's 20. We won 20, I believe. No. No, it's not 20? No. No. So that's, oh, I'm sorry. That's the, how many divisions. We won 20 division championships. And the NFC championship, I believe it's like 15 or 17. That's not right. 15 that's NFC right. Western Division championships. Not, oh, he said 15. Yeah, he had that, that right. That was it. Yeah. So then in order to, to, you had to win the West. But that don't necessarily mean you won the West 15 times. You could win more because y'all may not have made it to the. Uh, right. We yeah, we won the division twenty times and then we won the So division. how many times did they win the division? Twenty? Division? Yeah. yeah. That's what you asked them. NFC NFC West. That's NFC the West. 
division championships is 15. Yeah. Okay. How many, um, give me like about three jerseys that's retired. Three jerseys that's retired? Yeah. Rice. Well, yeah, oh, obviously man. Rice. That's easy I didn't ask 16. Yeah. <laughs> Taylor. Easy, man. That's yeah. easy. Easy. Right, yeah. All right, Taylor uh, isn't on there. Oh, oh Taylor's right. not on there yet? Taylor's not on there. Well, we uh, got Clark, the, the 87. Tony Gonzalez. Clark is on there. Dwight Clark, yeah. Jerry Rice. All right, but Bob us. St. Clair. Leo, uh, Nama Lenny, Charlie Kruger, Ronnie Lott, yep. um, Jimmy Johnson, Jimmy Johnson, yeah, 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 yeah. Joe Perry, he, he was like a Montana Brody, Brody and, and, and Young. Yeah. Who, Garoppolo I, got a lot I, of big shoes. How many y'all got? Sounds like a lot of big shoes. For the shoes, Chiefs, I can, I can name. Can he do it? For the Chiefs, can I can, can name. Can he do it? He got one full year under his belt. Can Who? he do it? Garoppolo. We 15 to 3, homie. One no. full record? year. Who what, what, I mean, what happened last year? time y'all played the Chiefs? Did y'all win or lose? Give me something. Give me something. We lost that year, but that's okay. the year. That's what I'm talking about. We, Give me no, some man. Numbers. Okay. Numbers okay. retired. Uh, our, our, our players. 80, 80, uh, Tony Gonzalez, 88. Christian DeCoye. No. No Tony Gonzalez. They haven't retired. They nigga, haven't they retired Tony. They, they retired Tony Gonzalez yeah. jersey this year. Nigga, yeah. I watched the game when he was there. What the fuck is you talking about? Yeah. His facts aren't up to date. Tony Gonzalez jersey has been retired for Kansas City. Um. Uh, number 16, yeah. fucking Lynn Dawson's jersey has yeah. been retired for Kansas yeah. City. Um, the defense nigga, what's that nigga's name? Uh, Thomas. Derek, Derek Thomas, Thomas Derek obviously. Derek Thomas. Number 58. Um, there's another defensive nigga back in the 70s. Mm -hmm. Is it Earl? Earl somebody. No. I forget his name. Anyway, he was like a strong safety or something, right? Willie L Langer? That's strong like, safety. You got, you got strong safety would be Mac Lee Hill or Stone Johnson. I just know one of the niggas that we retired was a strong safety. Or Abner Haynes. There, here's the funny thing. There's a lot of great Chiefs um, that nobody even talks about anymore. Um, like uh, uh, Carter, dude, that was, he was uh, a... He was defense. Uh, I wanna, it's not Daryl Carter. Uh, started a fucking D. I know what you're talking about. I can't even place it. Damn. Anyway, how many Super Bowls has Andy Reid won? None. Zero. Bong! One! It's his turn. Hey, nigga! It's his turn. Zero. We got Rob. We celebrated. We got Rob. And that was the year of Spygate, and we got Rob. Spygate and Donovan McNabb punked out at the time. T.O. had a broken leg. T.O. had a broken ankle. Actually, T.O. balled the fuck out that game. He still had a broke leg. He had a broke leg. Imagine if the nigga had two good legs. We would have won. We would have blown them niggas out. Do you know? Spygate, nigga. He coming back for yeah. redemption, yeah, goddammit. Right. Do, you know, do you know? Do you know? Do you know the longest kickoff return from y'all? Uh, 106 yards, or 107, one or two. It can't be. That's longer than the end zone. Because it goes that? to the back of the end zone. Back of the end zone. Back the end zone to white the back to white. Dante Hall. White. White. No. Or Dante Hall or Tariq Hill, one of the two. No, it was Nolan Smith in 67. Oh, so Who the fuck going on? But, them niggas have, but these <laughs> niggas have tied. He said it's 67. <laughs> Way before. Nigga, he told me to come up with questions. Nigga, like, Absolutely. questions, I, questions I, that listen, he don't know. I appreciate know. it. I appreciate it. Man, fuck that. Do you Ooh. know the year of your first winning season? Chiefs? Yeah. Uh, well, since he been I alive. guess would, would that count as <laughs> hold on, hold on. Time out. So, so would that count as the 19th? Let me see. 50, 50. Y'all came in 59 or something like that. Okay, so it would have to be, obviously. Be and that, you talk, that nigga's talking about, like, when they first was the Dallas Texans. You know what I'm saying? They probably created the AFC, and then they moved to Kansas City. So um, I don't think they were winning as the Dallas Texans. I think they were all right. Um, once they moved to Kansas City, I know they started winning probably with uh, – Hell, that first or second Dawson. year? Dawson. Yeah. Dawson. 1960, y'all was 8 and 6. There it is. That's around that time. <coughs> uh, 49ers. 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 Yeah. Um, you can come. I'm coming, nigga. We was nigga. established I'm in coming. 1964 as an American all team. Don't turn off your goddamn Google, nigga. Ain't no Google. <laughs> Ain't no Google. <laughs> Let me sit here. We, we, uh -huh. we, we, joined, we joined the national 19 what? 19 what? Six, uh, 1964. Uh, no. I'm sorry, 48? No. Uh, 48? No. Of uh, 46, I'm sorry. 46. It was 46 to 48, right. and then we moved over to the national championship in 1950, the uh, American uh, NFL in 1950, and right. we've been there ever since. Yep. We have moved stadiums three times. 
Well, we no, gonna, nobody care about that shit, nigga. We gonna have one stadium in Kansas City, and, nigga. And, and, nobody and, care uh, about and, that uh, shit. And, uh, and, uh, you care. Don't be mad. No, I don't, Eagle nigga. Fan. Goddamn right, nigga. <laughs> Who did y'all take y'all first loss to in y'all new stadium? And I, oh, I, oh, that's a good question. I don't oh, know. The Eagles. Uh, no, <laughs> no, it wasn't the Eagles. I don't. I, I can't answer that. I don't know. Chicago that. Bears. Bears. <laughs> Nobody care about that shit, man. Nobody care about that shit, man. That nigga snuffed them motherfuckers in there somehow. Nobody care about that shit, man. He saw that and ran with it, dude. Yeah, yeah, he did. That's good. Chicago. Props. Props to that. Who do y'all have? Who's y'all most um, rushes? Who? Oh, uh, it's Frank Gore right now. Frank right, Gore's the lead, bro. Right. Um, Number 21 for life. The most passing. Most passing yards. Mm-hmm. Steve Young or Joe Steve Montana? Young or yeah. Montana? I Which think one? it's Steve. It's Mo Steve. John Tanner. Steve Young or Montana? It's Montana. Mo Montana? Montana He's the it. fucking greatest. Fuck yeah, Tom Brady. Right he is the greatest. Until number 15 came along. Now he's you know going to be the goat. Who has the most receiving yards? Well, 15 mo- ain't oh, done. Oh, Jerry. He, Jerry Rice. He going to get but, it. Uh, that nigga 15 ain't started yet. <laughs> and I know. That nigga, he's, he's and that nigga, listen, 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 you know what I mean? Listen, the, the race barely started, and that nigga's already lapped these niggas. My what was y'all <laughs> first Super Who did y'all play in your first Super Bowl appearance? Uh, I want to say Cincinnati because we beat them twice. I don't know if that, that was 81. Nah, that, nah see, I played Cincinnati in 86. We played them twice. We played them twice, and we beat them twice for the Super Bowl each time. I know y'all played them in 88. 82, they beat Cincinnati. Yeah. 82. <laughs> but then they also beat them in 88. Yeah. Uh, the first one, I don't I don't know who the that, first the, 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 uh, I just told you, Cincinnati. Nicky Woods. Woods 82. 82. Okay. What's that? Yeah, Nicky 88 Woods. was Nicky Woods. 81, yeah. 81 yeah. Shuffle. Yeah, that's yep. Nicky Shuffle. I remember that. Um, See, I know, I know, listen, I know a lot of San Fran history up until about 95. Okay. Do you well, th- both y'all niggas. Do you know who y'all, y'all first draft choice was when y'all first came into the NFL? Uh, no, that was 1950. I wasn't even born. Yo, and is. he knows, though. Leo Namalini. Yeah, I don't even know who that is. How do you know? How, I well, so why do you say he knows? Because <laughs> he, he knew it was 1950. Oh. I knew it was 1950, yeah. but I don't. I didn't yeah. know how our first draft pick yeah. was. That nigga said he knows, <laughs> and then gave the name like he no, knew the he year. Just said, I don't know. No, 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 no. No, he knew the year though. I mean, like, I like that. That's though. not when the question was. The question was, who was your first draft pick? Right. Yeah, I, I yeah, yeah you're right. He, he didn't know that, but he knew the year. Those are my questions. We gonna get victory tonight, baby. I'm sorry, Andy. I'm sorry, your boy 15. He gonna start his Super Bowl career off 0 and 1. See, that's what San Fran That's what they have to do to talk themselves into a victory. Hey, bro. Exactly. Momentum is on I'm going to tell you Kansas like City's this. Side. If you look we the hot boys. Yeah. Man, I got to say the hot boys. boys. You ain't hot. You ain't hot. <laughs> Let me tell you like this. There's nobody on that field tonight with the mama mentality. Right. Like number 15. Number 15. Patrick Mahomes is going to be the first quarterback since the 1970s to bring the championship back to Kansas City. Next year. Unfortunately, it has to be year. the demise of the 49ers. It's not there happening. There will be no we more 49ers talking happening. for the rest of this year. Until we the gonna new have a season parade. comes. And when the new season starts, they will talk about the 49ers as almost winning the Super Bowl of last year. It's not happening. Oh, really? That's why he watching it by himself. If you paying attention, oh, that's really? why he watching it by himself. Because <laughs> when he lose, he going to turn his phone off. He ain't going to have to I'm talk to nobody. Listen, I'm turning my phone off when or lose. I don't want to talk to nobody. When I talk to you, it's because I decided to talk to you. I'm going to tell you like this. I'm going to tell you like this. This thing is going to be the last motherfucker I call. I mean, I'm 50-50 with, I mean, with this game. You know what I'm saying? I mean, because, I mean, personally, personally, I mean, um... Watch us on YouTube to see this 49ers li- li- Listen, listen, li- listen. <laughs> Personally, I think this thing, I think this game is 50 50 because if the 49ers can run, we will. Li- Nigga, listen, we, hold on. Can I talk? Can I, about? can I talk? Hold on, hold on. Say, say what you want to say hold afterwards. On. Nigga, Derek, nigga, Derek, can I get my prediction? They said Henry, 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 and he got That's to see one, we developed the wall. I don't give a fuck about one y'all backups. Running back. If y'all see what we nigga got can't do three. it. Fuck your backups. We got three. Them niggas is back. Who got a point we, we there? We got stop three. Niggas going to get 20 slam yards a piece. You stop one running back. Can one you good. stop three? Them one niggas going to average 27 yards a piece. We got three great ones, motherfucker. He kind of do got a point there. Don't give a fuck about your We don't give a fuck about your opinion. Ask your question, Dice. Ask your question. Prediction. 
Nigga, what the fuck you think this is? Yeah, that's 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 a what's your up? prediction? I got my prediction. Shout out to my Bay Area homeboys. I got I'm sorry for your loss. I'm sorry for your loss, Kansas City. At least you can soak up some barbecue and eat that little sour sauce. I mean, I'm 50-50 with this shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? I mean, listen. Hey, when you're at the edge of the wall, right. don't forget to call Paul. <laughs> he will walk you through it and talk you off the ledge. <laughs> I guess I'm not going to get my prediction. I got my prediction. Fuck your prediction. Your prediction? What's your go prediction, Kush? Go ahead. Go ahead. Eagles, fuck about his Eagles next mind. season. No, you, you That's got my prediction. Go Eagles next Eagles, season. Man. That's my prediction. You next. Hey. This has been another shout out to Andy of... Reid and LaShawn McCoy. Let, let Dice give his let prediction. Let Dice get his prediction in. Just say it. Chiefs of what? Bears 2025. Chiefs and Niners. Listen, bro. Chiefs and Niners. Bears 2025. This has been another episode of Barbershop, Barbershop Talk, Talk Like This. this. <laughs> I'm your host, the Super Bowl champ, Trey Not Barber. Not tonight. <laughs> Not tonight. I ain't got shit to say. Dice in the building. <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing at Dice. Kush. <laughs> D. White, 49er fans. Brian Lugo. Get in the house. And we out this bitch. Cheese. 49ers. Kingdom. That's fucking